banana and plantain is an important and the number one fruit crops in india in india it is cultivated in 7.0 lakh hectares with a production of 26.22 million tons it is mainly grown in the states of tamil nadu andhra pradesh maharashtra karnataka kerala and gujarat national research center for banana was established in 1993 at tiruchirappalli tamil nadu under the aegis of indian council of agriculture research with a mandate to undertake technology development and a dissemination to increase production and productivity in banana and plantain in the country india is one of the centers of origin and diversity for banana and plantain the national research center for banana has the mandate to collect all banana varieties being the national repository for banana a core collection for banana and plantains has been established and consequently this center has become one of the asia's largest banana field gene banks with 310 accessions representing the entire musa diversity for wild wild relatives land raises and cultivated types which are field conserved characterized by both morphotaxonomically and using molecular techniques like ssr irap and stms markers an in vitro gene bank for 60 exotic accessions is also being maintained in vitro multiplication protocols have been standardized protocol has been developed for the establishment of embryogenic cell suspensions evaluation of the accession of indigenous and exotic origins has led to identification of superior five selections one selection was released as udayam in 2005 by honorable agricultural minister shri sharad pawar ji availability of disease free quality planting material is the major constraint in banana production to overcome this farmer friendly technologies have been developed banana being parthenocarpic sterile with different ploidy levels protocol has been developed for the zygotic embryo rescue and embryo culture techniques have been developed in 1970s the national average of banana productivity was less than 15 tons due to the development of improved production technologies and adoption by the banana farmers a phenomenal 4 to 5 fold increase in banana production and an exponential growth was recorded as a result maharashtra state records the highest productivity of 60 to 70 tons followed by gujarat and tamil nadu and individual farmers are obtaining 90 to 100 tons still There are many constraints which need attention of researchers like reducing the cost of production and increasing the productivity and profitability of the farmers. In this endeavor, this center has evolved many improved technologies like high density planting and clump management with planting of 3 suckers per hill, paired row planting of 4500 to 5200 plants per hectare coupled with drip fertigation strategies etc these technologies enhance the water and fertilizer productivity by 30% water 25% fertilizer and increased productivity by 40% two time bunch spraying of 2% potassium sulfate solution after male bud removal at 30 days interval has been found to increase the yield by 20% a new technology of bunch covering with polythene sleeves of 100 gauge thickness with 6% ventilation produces blemish less bunches free from insects and disease incidences which fetch good price in the market in general farmers are unaware of micronutrient deficiency symptoms in banana and as an attempt to create awareness and to demonstrate importance of micronutrients a banana micronutrient mixture named banana shakti has been formulated in this center the center has developed soil test based fertilizer adjustment equations for obtaining maximum profit from optimum fertilizer application 
in many commercial banana cultivars. Management of fusarium wilt disease, bacterial head rot disease in tissue culture plants and leaf spot disease in banana are very important in banana production. Since chemical control is not that much effective, various biocontrol agents like Trichoderma viridi, Pseudomonas fluorescens, etc. for managing wilt disease and using botanical extracts for managing Sigatoka leaf spot disease of banana have been developed in this center. To tackle the virus-free production of tissue-cultured banana plants, this center has developed molecular diagnostic kits like ELISA, PCR and NASH based diagnostic techniques for identification and eradication of major banana virus diseases like banana bunchy top, banana brack mosaic, banana streak and cucumber mosaic virus. To develop bunchy top virus resistant hill banana plants, efforts are on to produce transgenic plants using coat protein techniques. Nowadays, in banana, com and pseudo stem weevils emerge as major threat in banana production. An eco-friendly technology, banana pseudo stem traps for stem weevil has been developed. A biocontrol agent, Bavaria baziana, against stem and corn weevils has also been developed and commercialized to tarry Tanjaur. In banana farming, burrowing nematodes root lesion nematodes, root knot nematodes, spiral nematodes and cyst nematodes pose major threat leading to yield loss of about 30% in banana. Intercultivation of tagetus species, biocontrol methods using trichoderma viridi, pseudomonas fluorescens and mycorrhizae have been standardized for management of major nematodes of banana. India is number one in banana production and productivity in the global scenario. Yet, it has no place in the list of global banana exporting countries. A survey indicated that the post-harvest loss occurs in India to the tune of 20% due to the lack of proper handling, packaging and processing. This center has carried out research activities to develop suitable post-harvest strategies and evolved technologies including various banana based value added products which are transferred to banana farmers and appreciated nationwide. As banana is highly perishable in nature, it has to reach consumer at retail market within 5 days for optimum profit, else farmers incur heavy loss due to over ripening and decaying of fruits. As an alternate to this problem, this center has developed protocol for preparing more than 20 value-added byproducts from banana like fig, jam, juice, jelly, health drink, banana powder, baby food, flour pickle, chutney, banana sauce, chips, banana wine, etc. This center has developed protocol for extracting banana stem fiber and for preparing different handicrafts like wall hangings, handbags, garlands, table mats, lampshades, jewel box, etc. This center also has 98 acres of research farm, glass house with temperature and humidity control, net house, etc. The biotechnology and the virology laboratories are accredited by DBT, Government of India. The National Research Center has conducted trainings for farmers from different states of India under National Horticultural Mission, post-harvest trainings, four national conferences, two international conferences, Kisan Melas for the benefit of the banana growers. This center strives to achieve the Indian banana production target of 50 million tons by 2020 AD for sufficiency for both domestic and export needs. Jai Hind!